Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome to Elevate My World 2023. You have tuned in with your girl Roro. You have tuned in with your girl Roro. And I was just, I was going to wait, but I was a little too excited. So I'm like, you know what? I did my little show, my little short introducing that I had got this beautiful blessing. But I'm like, you know what? Let's go on and make a video out of it. You know what I'm saying? Let's make a video out of it. My son had been in my tail about not uploading my videos. He's like, Mom, you haven't uploaded a video in about a year. I need you to get to work. So here we are. You know what I'm saying? Your girl is back in the field. I'm excited to be back. I pray that the right individual, you know what I'm saying, welcome me in and bless me in. If you are new, hey, how you doing? What's up? How you doing? If you are returning subscriber, what it do, baby? I am, as you all, if you didn't see, like I said in my short, I am organizing a blessing that I received over the weekend. So I am the kind of person, you know what I'm saying? I just... I do my best to be transparent and show that I understand life likes, you know what I'm saying? And um, my dang on astigmatism is acting up, so excuse me if you see me wiping my eye, I'm not crying. I have uh, I have 70% uh, astigmatism in my left eye, so it's acting up today, you know what I'm saying? And um, yeah, my son is like, get to work, mom, you know what I'm saying? You need to get in the field, you be in my butt about everything, I need you to get in the field. So your girl is back in the field, you know what I'm saying, reevaluating some things, reorganizing some things, you know what I'm saying, just understanding and respecting my journey the way that I have to respect my journey, you know what I'm saying, because some people fall off the bandwagon because they're so worried about what the next person thinks, you know what I'm saying, and I've never really been that kind of person, but it seemed like the older I got, you know, with the times changing everything, it kind of like, it kind of crept up on me and it tried to creep into my spirit. But I'm here to let the devil know that you ain't running nothing, partner. You ain't running nothing. You ain't running nothing, baby. You ain't running nothing. You ain't running nothing. He think he running something, but he ain't running nothing at all. You know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna do my best to keep this message short, sweet, and simple. You know what I'm saying? Because some individuals don't like watching long videos. Some do, some don't. But, um, hold on, I'm trying to pay attention so I don't cut myself. But yeah, go after your dreams, y'all. Go after your dreams, don't care what nobody say, nobody think, and do what you need to do. You know what I'm saying? If, if, if the Father placed a vision in your spirit those that understand what I'm talking about understand what I'm talking about. If the Father placed a vision in your spirit, execute it. But do your best to not lean upon your understanding. You know what I'm saying? Go to the Father with every step of the way and He will direct you with everything that you are confused about or you are skeptical about. You know what I'm saying? Just take it to the Father. He'll get you in order. He will definitely get you in order. So, to speak a little bit about this blessing. Over the weekend, I had got a um, a pedicure client. You know what I'm saying? My neighbor wanted her nails done. She was going out to Vegas this weekend. You know what I'm saying? My girl will be back Tuesday. And um, she wanted me to do her toes and her nails. She wanted a, a press-on set. I executed her press-on set. But unfortunately, the night that she got her toes done, we didn't have time to knock out the... Um, the uh, the custom set so I did it here you know what I'm saying and she didn't have time to pick it up so you know it is what it is whatever the case may be and um she said she'll grab it Tuesday and I'm like okay no big deal you know what I'm saying and being that she blessed me with this travel kit you know what I'm saying this here travel kit with at least at least at least a hundred dollars worth of um eighty to a hundred dollars I would say 40 to $60 worth of merchandise in the travel kit. But the travel kit itself is not cheap. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know, my nail techs know the travel kit itself, the travel kit itself is not cheap. You know what I'm saying? So 
that was nothing but a, a right on time blessing. I had been looking at some travel kits because I've been getting requests, you know what I'm saying, to come to some individuals and do nails, you know what I'm saying? I've been getting requests, hey, can you come here? Can you come here? You know what I'm saying? I'll charge you this amount, da 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 And um, I'm like, Father, I need a travel kit, you know what I'm saying? But my finances, the way life is, lifing, my finances wasn't reaching the goal, you know what I'm saying? So... Before she came, you know what I'm saying, she got it together and everything. She pulled it out of her garage and whatnot for me. And when she came to the appointment, she came in with this. And I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm thinking to myself, like, what is, what is this girl up to? You know what I'm saying? What is this? You know what I'm saying? And um, I didn't really actually notice what it was until she got in my door and she stood in my living room. And she told me, you know what I'm saying, what's what, was it, was it, you know what I'm saying? And, um excuse my french you know what i'm saying i am from chicago and this is how we talk in chicago so i no longer reside in chicago but you know what i'm saying you can take the girl out of chicago but you can't take chicago out of the girl i don't care what nobody say you know what i'm saying excluding the extra ghetto parts you know what i'm saying don't get me wrong everyone has a ghetto side to them everybody got a smidge of the ghetto in them and um I try my best to not dig into that. You know what I'm saying? I try to stay as sophisticated as possible, but also keep that 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 the authenticness to myself, you know what I'm saying? But um yeah, I am sanitizing everything because just to be truthful with myself, I don't know how many hands touch this, but a blessing is a blessing, so I'm going to sanitize this blessing so I can utilize this blessing. And um I'm just marveling in everything that she gave me. Like I got a thousand different type of chrome powders, like everything in here. My budget was not really reaching, you know what I'm saying? Like literally everything in here from the dappin dish. I was thinking about getting a new dappin dish. I was thinking about getting new acrylics. I was thinking about getting these chrome powders. I was going to level up on my bling. Um, I got some, some, um, some, nail foils that i had been looking at like when i say your girl was like over here tripping like father like i know you blessed me with this journey you know what i'm saying no one the father blessed you with your journey you know what i'm saying don't be around here trying to force something you know what i'm saying and um little by little everything started to literally fall in to lie just fall in the line you know what i'm saying the finances for my nail table the finances for my my decor for my for my nail salon shop you know what i'm saying which i have accumulated here in my living room i started four years ago in my kitchen y'all four years ago in my kitchen i was pregnant with my four-year-old you know what i'm saying and um i was like father if this is a journey that you have for me to go on you know what i'm saying show me that you want me to go on this journey and little by little you know what i'm saying i started getting clients you know what i'm saying i started accumulating the funds to get the materials and whatnot and the extra ideas you know what i'm saying to extend it into my living room because my kitchen is small but it's not that small but i am a little ocd so i'm like i don't feel comfortable doing nails in my kitchen you know what i'm saying it feels a little unsanitary to me so father gave me the idea to extend it into my living room. You know what I'm saying? My living room is a nice size living room. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I have always been the kind of individual that never really wanted company in my living room because people just get too comfortable. They see you got the space and they want to stay and they want to spend a night. Then they want to ask, can they live with you? No. You know what I'm saying? So father was like, let's go this route. You know what I'm saying? Let's go this route. You know what I'm saying? I am going to accumulate a piece of furniture extra than what i am sitting on you know what i'm saying so when my clients come they can sit they can rest they can wait if i'm not on point when they come you know what i'm saying you can sit you can rest you can wait you know what i'm saying you can watch tv you can eat some snacks you know what i'm saying i got another idea coming up you know what i'm saying for my area my nail my my, my uh, nail shop and whatnot but um i'm not gonna speak on that we're not gonna speak on that y'all just gonna see it when it unfold you know what i'm saying i know how that go i'm not gonna you know what i'm saying sabotage my blessings by speaking too early on them you know what i'm saying i know some folks want to want to hear it so they can come up with some ideas because you got some individuals that are you know what i'm saying eager to start their journey but they don't know where to start 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 through the father ask the father where do i start what is it that you need for me to buy first 
You know what I'm saying? What is it that is really important that you want me to purchase first to get this journey started? Whatever the journey is, you know what I'm saying? It could be starting a nail salon. It could be starting a daycare. It could be starting a health center. It don't really matter what it is. Ask the father first, you know what I'm saying? And he will genuinely direct you in the direction that he, 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 um, he understands that you're going to be capable of handling. You know what I'm saying? Because the father does not put more on you than you can bear. You know what I'm saying? If it's going to be too much, he's going to give it to you little by little. So you can get to that point where you can handle everything. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. I um, I ain't going to be on here too long. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to try to make this video a little lengthy, but not too lengthy. You know what I'm saying? So I can get some nice pointers across. And, um, yeah, I am very excited about this journey. My little seven-year-old and my two-year-old, they can't stay out of my nail area. For real, for real. Like, every time I'm in my nail table, my two-year-old, mostly my two-year-old, is at this dang on, you know what I'm saying, nail area trying to figure out what is that you're doing. She's always looking and touching and examining and, oh, excuse me. She likes to sit in my nail chair and she likes to sometimes spin in the chair or she'll sit at the table and she'll just admire everything. You see what I'm saying? And it just blows my mind. Now, my seven-year-old, she's on her own little journey. You know what I'm saying? She's the one that gives me certain nail ideas, you know what I'm saying, to do. And um, I love that because I'm learning that she is just as creative as her mother. You know what I'm saying? My two-year-old, she's just in awe because she's two. You know how two-year-olds are. She's in awe, you know what I'm saying? She's curious about what mommy is doing. She doesn't fully fleshly understand, but she knows that mommy is doing something dope. She know mommy is doing something cool. So she be down here every chance that I get once I get her ready for the day, you know what I'm saying? And she, you know what I'm saying? She feed herself and stuff like that. And I let her loose. When I let her loose, y'all, she be down here in this area with me, baby. She be down here with me. I be wanting her to be upstairs, chilling, watching her little cartoons, playing with some toys. But she be in the shop with mommy, baby. She definitely be in the shop with her mama. Uh-oh. I don't want to lose or misplace anything. Because I'm definitely going to be putting what I sanitize over there in the area with everything else. You know what I'm saying? To add on to the collection. You know what I'm saying? And then when due time come, I'm going to be able to elevate from that. You know what I'm saying? Don't ever get discouraged because you never know how the Father going to bless you. You never know how the Father going to bless you. I wasn't really getting discouraged. I was being as patient as possible. And I swear to goodness I was. And sure enough, you know what I'm saying? She's like, hey, I got this travel kit for you. You know what I'm saying? I was thinking about doing nails, but I don't have the patience for it is what my client said. You know what I'm saying? I'm speaking of her words. She was like, hey, I got this travel kit that I'm no longer using. I was thinking about doing nails, but I have double amount of kids than you do. And I don't have the time. On top of that, I don't have the patience. So you give me what you feel is worth. And I was like, you know what? Immediately, the father was like, boom, your toes is on me. Your toes is on me. You know what I'm saying? Because the, the, the style that she was getting was half pricely equivalent to what's in this dang on travel kit you know what i'm saying so i was like boom immediately the father was like your toes is on me you know what i'm saying just pay for your your uh press on set and your toes could be for me and we'll work out something else a little bit later as far as the worth and whatnot and i was like we can do that you know what i'm saying because that's just the kind of person that i am because i understand that life is lifing and nobody is better than the next so, you know what I'm saying? Always, 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 always humble yourself because you never know. You never know. You never, never, ever, 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 ever know how the Father is going to bless you and accommodate your wants and your needs. You know what I'm saying? No matter what it is, it could be for a new car. It could be for a new uh, a new vehicle. Um, yeah, a new car. It could be for a new crib. It could be for the new baby. You never know how the Father is going to, you know what I'm saying, bless you. And help you realize I am by your side. I understand. I'm by your side. And we got this. We got this. We definitely got this. So I got my sanitized wipes. I got my sanitized wipes. 
that my uh, children's father had blessed me with. He gave me a nice sized bag of sanitation wipes. So I'm just sanitizing everything before I put it over in the area and whatnot. And then I'm going to vacuum. I'm going to vacuum the inside, the inside of the travel kit. And I'll probably put it to the side. So when it's time to utilize it, I can pull it on out and put everything in it that I may need for that client or whatever the case may be. And um, be my little booty on out the door. You know what I'm saying? So I am very, very, very much so like a kid in the candy store right now. I swear to God I am. When I say I have nail tips, I have chrome powders, um, the stencils that I showed you, the little, um, I can't think of what this is called. It's like a, uh, it's like aluminum foil that we put on the nails, y'all. I got so many different colors and designs of these. And I'm like, Father, you really showed your tail. You really showed your tail. You really, really showed your tail. Because on top of me not being able to full-fledgedly afford it, I buy things according to my finances. So I hadn't also gotten around to getting a lot of these things. I was going to get there. You know what I'm saying? But it was just taking a little bit longer than usual because I am a mom. I'm a single mom. I'm doing all of this by myself. You know what I'm saying? I don't really have anybody to, you know what I'm saying, help me with this journey. And Father was like, you don't really need nobody to help you full-fledgedly. You know what I'm saying? You got me. You definitely got me. So, yeah, I am taking this blessing with a grain of salt. And I am like a kid in the candy store. Kid in the candy store. I, I literally could have waited later on this week because there's some other stuff that I got to do upstairs in my room and my kids' bedroom. But I'm not tripping about that. You know what I'm saying? This is a little bit more, you know what I'm saying, important. You know what I'm saying? Like me organizing the rooms and stuff like that. I can do that over the weekend on my downtime. You know what I'm saying? And um, I wanted to come down here and get this situated and get everything in order and uh, get back to work because the clients are slowly but surely rolling in. So I wanted this on point. So when the next clients come in, I could be like, hey, I got boom, 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 boom. How would you like your nails? You know what I'm saying? So yeah, that is pretty much all that I had to say. Um, don't stop chasing your dreams, no matter who may not believe in you. You believe in you. You believe in you. You believe in you because the Father believes in you. Look at that. Look at that. And majority of these little containers of acrylic powders and chrome powders, they're pretty, you know what I'm saying? They're not really that much utilized. It's still a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. So I'm going to get a nice use out of each and every product. Each and every product. Everything from drill bits to um bling um all kind of little you know what i'm saying little knickknacks i am so stinking excited i got some glow in the dark bling like all kind of good little cute little stuff you know what i'm saying that i haven't had a chance to accumulate just yet you know what i'm saying this was definitely a out of the blue blessing uh, out of the blue blessing you know what i'm saying i'm thinking i'm about to just do some nails and here she come with a whole blessing for you girl on top of what i'm already on you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. so if you you know what i'm saying have some things and you know you're not using them bless somebody with it okay bless somebody with it especially if you know you're not gonna use it if you really need the finances it is okay to sell it to somebody that you know can use it but don't do a outrageous price because life is life and for everybody but don't don't um don't belittle yourself and don't settle you know what i'm saying sell it for what you feel is worth you know what i'm saying sell it for what you what you need the finances for you know what i'm saying but don't be extra greedy be realistic about it you know what i'm saying be very 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 realistic about it so I just want to hop in and say that, you know what I'm saying? Be be a be an inspiration to somebody else. Be a blessing to somebody else. If you actually know that you can, be a blessing to somebody else because that is one of my niches. I love being a blessing to somebody else. You know what I'm saying? Because 
we have to remember first and foremost we cannot take none of these things to heaven or hell with us you know what i'm saying so pay it forward to somebody if you're not using it and it's just sitting there collecting dust taking up space you know what i'm saying like in my closet i got buku kid shoes and clothes and all kind of stuff that i am about to get in the process to prepare to give to somebody that can utilize it because there's a lot of people that don't have out here life is really lifing life is really lifing and the devil is really being busy so you know what i'm saying be a blessing to somebody because you never know how the father is going to re-bless you you never know how the father is going to re-bless you you know what i'm saying and like i said this here travel kit with the materials was right on time the holidays are picking up people are coming in ladies the ladies are coming in for their uh for their sets for their toes to be done and stuff like that so baby when i say i don't have to buy products for at least at least about another month you know what i'm saying maybe the the plans that um father has in store for me for um november i ain't gotta buy much like i can i can get extra things but i literally just got everything that i was praying about i literally just got everything i was praying for like for real for real so if i do decide to buy some things i can buy it not so big and not so in, in in such a big of a bulk if i'm making any sense i don't have to buy it in such a big of a bulk you know what i'm saying i can get it little by little because this right here is the nail foils for example my nail text y'all know what i'm saying this stuff lasts you know what i'm saying because some some nail sets you're not even putting all of the nail foils on all the all 10 fingers you might be putting it on one to two fingers or three fingers so it stretches you know what i'm saying so you really don't have to buy that much you know what i'm saying we don't do that on purpose that's just the way that the ladies be wanting their nails they might want one finger with a nail foil on it you know what i'm saying one finger with a little bling and a little you know what i'm saying designs and decorations so everything that we buy it actually stretches you know what i'm saying even even outside of you having actual nail clients if you're still in practice mode it still stretches it still stretches you know what i'm saying so whew. I've, 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 when I say I've gave the Father his his praise and worship, I've done my shouting, I've done my thanking, I've done my crying, I've done my, you know what I'm saying, all of that. You know what I'm saying? My hallelujah goes to the Father first. My hallelujah goes to the Father first. My yes, I've learned to give it to the Father first because when people fail you and they say one thing but do another, the Father don't do that. The Father don't do that. You know what I'm saying? But don't be that kind of individual out here not trusting the Father's way because he'll He'll bless you with some people and they'll throw you some blessings. Don't be out here being too strong and denying these blessings. You know what I'm saying? Don't be out here being too strong and denying these blessings. You see what I'm saying? So take your blessings in a grain of salt and utilize them to the best of your ability. You know what I'm saying? Utilize them according to your situation or whatever the case may be. But um, I think I've blabbed enough. I got to get ready and open up the shop um, and all that good stuff. I still got to clean off my table from when I did my client over the weekend. And um, yeah, I got quite a few things to do down in the shop today. I got to vacuum. I got to organize. I got to disinfect all that good stuff so i just want to come in and drop them gems like that you know what i'm saying and let y'all know that anything is possible when you keep the faith anything is possible when you keep the faith that faith the size of a mustard seed i'm gonna keep instilling it in your spirit i'm gonna keep instilling it in your spirit and i know father got some people in your circle that is doing the same thing so i'm just to add on on the positive bandwagon you know what i'm saying so keep that faith the size of a bust of seed and again i thank y'all for tuning in and watching my video comment in the comments tell me what you think you know what i'm saying tell me what you know what i'm saying give me some nail ideas or whatever the case may be here papa my cat playing with his little ball and um yeah utilize your blessings to the best of your ability utilize them blessings 
Don't be ashamed. Don't let nobody deter you. Don't let nobody make you feel bad. Don't let nobody make you feel broke. If you broke, you broke. So what? Everybody is broke right now. But you got some individuals that are really capping and living outside of their means. But we're not here to worry about them individuals. We're here to pray for them individuals. So the father get their mindset in alignment with what he wants them to be in alignment with. You know what I'm saying? We're not going to harp on them. We're not going to stress about them. We're not going to be forcing anything down their throat. Father is going to get them in order according to his will and his way and their journey and their situations. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Yeah. Tell me what you think about this video. You know what I'm saying? Tell me what I could do a little bit better or what I can switch up, whatever the case may be. Don't critique me too much because I'm very, you know what I'm saying? I'm very uh, spontaneous. You know what I'm saying? I go according to how the father wants me to do things mostly, but I am very, very, very open to ideas and um, positive, constructive criticism. You know what I'm saying? I know the difference between critiquing negatively and being in control, trying to be in control of somebody. You know what I'm saying? But I am open to positive, constructive criticism. So, again, you have tuned in to Elevate My World 2023. And um, I hope to see you. You know what I'm saying? I hope to see comments. I hope to see them hellos. I hope to see the, hey, keep going. You know what I'm saying? I'm looking forward to it. You know what I'm saying? And um, I am going to do my best to dish out the same thing because some days I have some slumpy days. I have some days where I just, you know, don't want to say anything and I don't want to be bothered. And I might not go live and I might not post a video, whatever the case may be. Like I said in my last previous, um, my last previous short, I have a busy schedule. You know what I'm saying? I have two autistic kids. And um, I have a, a, a normal two-year-old, you know what I'm saying? So my, my, my schedule is a little busy. So I'm not going to be on here all the time, but I'm going to be as consistent as my life allows me to be. I'm doing my best to come up with some content ideas. If you got some content ideas for me, you know what I'm saying? Drop it in the contest because sometimes I get brain farts. I get brain farts. I get creative, you know what I'm saying, creators brain farts you know what i'm saying throw me some ideas you know what i'm saying some video ideas you know what i'm saying and i would do my best you know what i'm saying i'll pray about it and see if the father you know what i'm saying is willing you know what i'm saying or whatever the case may be and i would i would do it i would do it you know what i'm saying yeah so that is that again you have tuned in to elevate my world 2023 if you are a returning subscriber what it do you know what i'm saying what it do baby what it do what it do what it do and if you are new hey how you doing i hope you decide to come on back if you like the content you know what i'm saying i'm not gonna force you we don't force anything over here my forcing days are over you know what i'm saying my extra days are over you know we strictly stand in our lane these days because it just fits me it's better it's not so stressful it's not so confusing it doesn't give me headaches but yeah, we're not forcing anything over here. If you like the content, you are more than welcome to come on back with your positive comments and your positive creative criticism. Do not come over here with that mess because you will get dismissed. You will get blocked. You will get unsubscribed. You will get restricted. You know what I'm saying? I really don't care if you don't like that, but it just is what it is. It just is what it is. But peace and love to y'all. Y'all stay blessed. Stay prayed up. Stay focused, and I love y'all.